Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or I should say, like, welcome to my channel. Um, I really never post, but like, I promise I'm gonna try and get better at that this summer. Um, if you're watching this, I guess this will be my first time making this kind of public, except to my friends and family who already know. Um, I actually left my full-time job, so right now I'm gonna be doing blogging, some online work full-time, so I'm super excited for that and a little bit nervous, um, which is why if you've been following me on Instagram, I've kind of been doing a lot of um, posts about if you're lost, finding your way, because that is something that I really do believe in, and I wanna start sharing more about that and start sharing more of my journey. So I'm gonna start documenting a little bit more. Um, as you can tell, I was out on my run, so kinda can't breathe. Um, but while I was running, I love listening to podcasts or like YouTubes and things like that. And today I was listening to Gary V and his podcast like literally had me in chills while I was running and listening to it. And that's the stuff that I love. Like that's the stuff that gets me going. Um, he was talking about, well, a lot, but one of the parts was like how you view the world. My arm is getting tired. <sighs> um, but like how you view the world. And I think the quote was something like, how people view the world is a direct correlation and the quickest tell of who they really are. And I really couldn't agree more with that. I thought that is um, something that's just like, I have to switch arms, oh my God, my hand hurts. But I thought that was something that's just like so true because it's basically a, pessimistic or an optimistic view on life. So um, I feel super thankful because I think that growing up in the family that I grew up in and with my dad and my mom, especially my dad, the most like optimistic human on the face of the earth, um, he has taught me to kind of roll with the punches, make the most out of things, just learn to laugh because why stress yourself out about something if you really can't even fix it? Um, the best example I can think of this is on Father's Day, my dad and I, we took the boat out and our boat broke down in the middle of the Long Island Sound. This is a super old boat. Like we have no radio, we have no walkie talkie. Thankfully we had my cell phone, um, but it was so fun. I mean, it was my dad and I on Father's Day just like spending time on a broken boat. Like so many people that I know that I can literally think off the top of my head would be someone who is stressing or like freaking out that the boat is broken like how are we ever gonna get in and then there's my dad and I just like cracking up like waving paddles in the air trying to get people to notice us and then people don't notice us because it's Father's Day and people are well not everyone but some people were like so self-centered and just wanted to get home and like no just love life I think that's so important I think it's important to be kind and I'm just looking around to see if anyone's like looking at me but it's just important to be kind and be positive and share those vibes and put those vibes out into the world because if you're sharing those positive vibes those are gonna be you're gonna feel those first like whatever you're putting out in the world whatever energy you're putting out that's the energy that you're gonna feel too and I think a lot of people if you're feeling like stressed or something you're not gonna make yourself feel better you're just gonna stress out other people around you so take care of yourself, love yourself, put those vibes out in the world and be optimistic, be positive. Your brain is, your brain is a muscle that can be trained. So you just need to work on it. If you start feeling those pessimistic vibes coming from you, just work on training your brain and making, turning that pessimistic into something that's optimistic and just try looking for the best in every situation. I promise you, it will make situations so much more bearable. Um, all right, stay tuned. Hopefully I'll be posting more videos. This is kind of just uh, something that came into my mind. My arm seriously hurts, which is why. Uh, oh my God, they're weak. I really need to do more push-ups. Uh, but yeah, um, stay tuned. I'm gonna try and post a lot more. Clearly I'm just walking around because I was running. I'm gonna go and get some water right now, kind of do a little bit of chilling. And then I'm gonna go back and work on my website. I don't know, I have a lot on my mind that I need to get going on, but I'm home for my trip, so. Now it's time. Thanks for listening if you even listened to all of this. Um, so appreciative. I'm just trying to share a little bit more with you guys and being a little bit more open and not doing um, kind of just like the perfect picture thing anymore because that's not really how life is and that's not real. So, yeah.